九娘子 ，You are welcoming us at the door this year. Because Li Zhang said, "Oh, welcome, guys. You're all here." What's going on? You seem absent-minded. Here, Zhu Ye flower seeds. I know this is the only flower you would use to make liquor. And here are two festoons with auspicious deer patterns. Not a fancy kind, but I made the pattern myself. Put it on the wall if you want. It will look as lovely as the horse paper cutouts you gave me last year. Oh dear, this is too much. I'll hang them up right away. Thank you so much. Oh, don't worry. To be honest, I didn't see that you would be welcoming us at the door. I thought I could sneak in and empty the jars before you showed up. Everyone is here. I'm not sure about that. I haven't counted them up yet. That might be Fa Cao. His family is here. Without him. Is he still patrolling? This late? Is he still looking for the foreign ladies? Perhaps. But it is not polite to keep other guests waiting. I see. Then let's start the party first. I'll save him his liquor. All right, everyone. The hostess has a toast to make. Please pay attention. Thank you. Here knows that I can't read and can't say some sweet words like toasting. Just say whatever you want. Don't interrupt her, you imbecile. Oh, all right. Well, <laughs> uh, where was I? A toast. Right, a toast. But I can't do it myself. So I copied a line from the book at the place where I work now. I like how it sounds. I bid thee all to drink and be merry. Do not stay thy hand from thine cup. Hope I didn't pronounce it wrong. It means people should drink and drink more. So you shouldn't say no to it. Is that so? Well, whatever. Anyhow. Thumbs up and fill your cups. Cheers! Cheers! You've always been nice and warm to me since I came here. I can't do anything in return but host this feast. Hope you enjoy the liquor and the dinner. I wish you a peaceful New Year's Eve. May all of your wishes come true in the coming Shuozhi. Uh, Li Zheng, do you have anything else to say? A peaceful New Year's Eve would be enough. Peaceful New Year's Eve. Peaceful New Year's Eve. Peaceful New Year's Eve.
You did a good job with the toast, Zhou Jiangzi. Looks like you've learned something from those love poems. You must have read them unconsciously after you stuck them on the wall. Oh, please. That custom is no longer popular in our neighborhood. I'd rather transfer the poem onto a kerchief and make a purse out of it, just like Zhou Niangzi did. It draws so much attention on the street. Actually, I still can't read what they write on the purse, <laughs> but the characters seem beautiful. What about the one you recited during the toast? You sounded really fluent. Who taught that to you? Oh, <laughs> that's from the former Jelly, the one who went back to her hometown. She taught me that. Speaking of her, is she going to come back? I didn't know any better, but by now she should be at home having New Year's Eve dinner. Did you hear from her? If she doesn't come back, you will have to work as the official Jili, who will take care of the tavern by then. The tavern has never had a reliable owner before you. It would have still been run down if you hadn't taken over it. Jin Niangzi is kind and warm-hearted. Such a girl of integrity can perform well in both running a tavern and being a Jili. You have a high regard for her, Li Zhen. Are you telling the truth or showing partiality? The truth, of course. What she said in the jersu a few hours ago is still vivid in my mind. I once again realize that it's never too late to learn. No, no, no. I'm not as good as you say. What did she say? Things like. One can remove the footsteps, but not the path one walketh on. Act not against the nature of thy flesh, for through it all things were made. She made it sound easy. Really? Absolutely. She is indeed illiterate, but she keeps learning and interprets the classic sayings in her own way. Even if there were other scholars, they would be convinced by her powerful speech. I, sadly, the one she confronted was not a human, but a Yao. Confronted a Yao in a Zhizi? Was that the Featherman? She thought the feather man was Zhang Rei, and asked him some questions. You actually asked him questions? He could have turned you into another striped horse. Um, I didn't think of that back then. This is the first time I've ever been so close to a Yao. He looks so similar to the ones in the books, so I... Jiu Niangzi. Jiu Niangzi, where are you? What? What happened? What is... Where is Jiu Niangzi? Here! I'm here! What's happening? Turns out those foreign ladies have been in league with Wu Tian the whole time. They helped him break out of jail and hid themselves in the wild with their arcane skills. I'm sure it will rain again soon, and it will be dangerous to stay in the wild. By then, they will come to you. Because you are the Feather Man's target. Jiu Niangzi, you... Hmm, you must leave here. You can't stay in the tavern. But it's... it's my tavern. Why am I leaving my own place? You are in danger. 
Since Guo Tian was able to break out of jail, he will for sure be able to break into the Jutsu. For your safety, I will have my soldiers escort you to the government office. That's the only safe place now. No, I'm not leaving. He is neither a Xiang Rei nor a strong Yao. Why are we afraid of him? Watch out! <gasps> She's right. You need not fear me. This lady owner of the tavern is the bigger concern here. Formation one! I knew you would come for her. Where are your accomplices? Are you the vanguard of the team? Zhou Niangzi, it's not too late for you to stop. No more turning people into a Lushu. Too many people have gone missing because of you. Turn people into a Lushu? But the wanted poster says those are striped horses. What is he talking about? What are you talking about? You know nothing about Lu Su. Besides, what do I have to do with the missing people? He's talking nonsense, right, Zhu Niangzi? Save the talk. Catch him first. Interesting words. Shh, you take it me. easy. Don't be so furious. Flying handbag for only 3,000 paper aunties. Hey! Take it easy. Is beating so loud. Flying handbag for only 3,000 paper aunties. Try for free. Try for free. It's called common sense. Bloody prop handle it gently. The ocean dried and I'm alone again. <laughs> Noble all over. Hey child, here's something fun for you. I will pray for you. Sorry. Surrender. 
and dispel your arcane skill. Turn the victims back to who they were. We will put an end to it before the Shuozhu. But I don't possess the power to transform people from one shape to another, and thus cannot turn them back. You're asking the wrong one. Why do you have to blame this on me? I've never met those missing people, and I have no idea what you're talking about. Is... is this because... Do you have a grudge against me or something? Nothing of that sort. I'm here only to prevent an unwanted escalation. I could have just walked away, and there's nothing you can do. I could have gone to other mountains, and life would have continued as it has always been. But for those who have been turned into half Lucius, no one can get them out of this trouble. Been turned into half Lucius? Are you saying that the animals in my backyard and those in the Jitsu. Are they all the missing people? But, but I thought they were just Lu Shus. The first time I saw them, it was clear that we were alike. We're just some... Half... Divine... Beasts. So they must not be humans. I've done nothing to... to transform them. I'm just taking good care of them, so that they can tell me where they're from, and if they can, take me home. The New Yang Mountain shelters the beasts. The beasts have white heads, red tails, the bodies of horses, and the markings of tigers. When they neigh, the sound becomes music. The name is Lushu. The striped horses you keep in the yard are half Lushus. They look like what's told in the tales, and they cry like humming songs in the moonlight. And the wooden dolls infuse your arcane skill, the shape of will, into the liquor which turns people into Lushus or half Lushu. As for the dolls, they were once soaked in the water of Peilin River. Were they not? The stream runs through the backyard. No. No way! They went there just for fun, or, or a bath! They should not... of a tiger and a red mane 
exactly what the Feather Man said. But its reflection is a woman? Oh my, the reflection. Is that the foreign lady from the street earlier? should be. But why are you still here? I don't see what you mean, Miss Chumansu. Oh, you're hurt. And, and you shouldn't be here. It's not right. You were able to recognize your teammates and had already left here. Wait, what? Boshimon. I. I get it! Chunan Si! You turned me into a Lushu because you thought that would help me find my teammates, didn't you? Last night, you said you'd help me, so this is how you... But I was not asking for help. I was only being emotional or pouring out my troubles. Anyway, I, I was not asking for anything from you. From the talk, I could feel the sincerity from the bottom of your heart. It was too real to be fake. I understand you were trying to help, and that was enough. But... but I don't understand! The Taoist said, the one who can protect and benefit the people shall be a Xiang Rei. If you can, but you don't, that would be wrong. I've done a terrible job. I'm not that majestic, nor do I look like any Xiang Rei's in the book. I can't even turn into a real Lu Shu. How is that enough? Jiu Niangzi, I think you need to tell us everything. Have you ever transformed people into loose shoes? Answer us! I, I swear that I was trying to help... To help everyone get what they want. Just, just like the former Jilly. She wanted to go back to her hometown. So I offered her a drink and sent her back. Jun Yangzi, do you understand what you are saying? I understand every word I say. Jun Yangzi, what have you done? You should have asked this a lot earlier. What did you do to the Jirli? I... She came to my tavern and complained that you didn't understand her at all, and that she was considering going back to her hometown. But it seemed far away from Pei City. She looked sad and tired, and didn't know what to do. So... so you... I must grant her wish. 
mustn't I? The Taoist said a Lu Shu can easily go a thousand miles within a day. If they start running, go faster, that will be over ten thousand miles. If that's how I can help her, I should definitely do that. You. Just like, like now. If the Peiling River dries out, you have nowhere to go. Just turn into Lu Shu's, and then you won't suffer. Lu Shu's can go anywhere they want. To the north, to the south, wherever they want. I can grant your wish differently, even if I can't recover the river from drought. I was thinking, going away freely might be a good choice. But, in the end... But, in the end... In the end, what I'm doing is... wrong? You. But if not by doing this, then what else can I do? Remember what you said to me last night? Liquor has many different names, but they're still liquor. You can put on many different clothes, but you will still be the same Junang Si. Likewise, whether you turn me into a horse, a donkey, or a Lushu, I will still be the same Yenise. You don't have to force yourself to become the people's strong ray. I think it's only an unreachable symbol. What matters is that the Junang say I know, but do whatever she could to help others. That's just what the Zhang Rei does, as far as I know. Even though some results turned out to be not so satisfying, your sincerity is as valuable as the Zhang Rei itself. So now, you just need to turn us all back. Yes, so turn back, where no path lies before you. It's never too late to return. I... I will. I will do my best. Alright, you can talk now. It's okay. I'll check you. Wait, save you. What? These handicrafts are able to talk. How could you be manipulated by them, Jiu Nangzi? No, no. You're getting it wrong! Don't save me! Li Zheng, I'm not manipulated! They're just wood! Well, they're indeed my friends. No, no, no. That's not for now. They just talk like that! That's not what they mean! This shall be the last time I put my trust in you. Ask them how to transform people back. 
But if you can't, You heard him. Now, please tell me how to turn them back into humans, will you? If it requires liquor, I'll get it for you. The Dawis? I didn't forget anything. And you... I see. You must be messing with me, because I treated you badly this morning. This is your revenge, right? It's not the time for it. I really need you to... No way. No, no, there must be a way. I must... I must be able to dispel my own craft. You must come to the Jutsu with me, Jun Yanzu. We'll see what we can do. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but I must fix it. I can fix it. This is all because of me. I need to... I will think carefully. Think of what I did before. I can do it. I can do it without them. our chance to break the ritual. The 
Southeast will be the weak spot of the sign colored wooden creature. What is that news? Please make it clear to us. We're running out of time. Facing the south and seeing the moon rise to the southeast, one may find a position of color. I see the fire appears alone, so the ritual has a flaw. Move with me. Is this? Careful. It is performing some kind of ritual. But we are getting too close. I need a full view of it. What are you doing? You can't just... I sense danger. Jung Alpha, stop the dolls immediately if you still have senses. Bloody prom! Take it easy! Ready a sereno intenso ad infinito! The 
ocean dried and I'm alone again. <laughs> Flying handbag for only 3,000 perfect aunties. Ugh, don't be so hard. It's all right. Handle it gently. Try for free. Try for free. Interesting work. Where's the car? Just be just allowed. A sword shot. I believe in you. An eye for an eye. Radio waves are everywhere. I know them all. Everything. This is an alien city. Sempre caro mi sucursal con cola. Feel this pain and know with regret. The crimson red manifests as fire, and the cyan stands for wind and thunder. The south east will be the weak spot of the cyan colored wooden creature. What's that mean, 
us. Please make it clear to us. We're running to... Please. Gently. I hear something. Whose car does he just allow? A tooth for a tooth. My child, here's something fun for you. Radio waves are everywhere. Don't be so furious. Everywhere. Pay for thy sins with my blood. Oh, don't be so hard. A sword shot. Take it easy. Handle it gently. Off that way. I know you can move. And this is an alien city. Try for free. Try for free. Woo -hoo. Thou shalt make an atonement for thy sins. In full. Take it easy. Handle it just bloody prompt. That's off the scale of jumping. Flying handbag for only 3,000 paper aunties. Hey! The ocean dried and I'm alone again. <laughs> the law is above all else. Easy, handle it gently. Maybe a way for everyone. A little bit hot here. The law is above all else. Oh, don't be so hard. He does allow. A truth for a I hear something. An eye for an eye. Agents have guns. It's called Pay for that fish with thy blood. Talking out, one to go down. <laughs> Take it easy. Handle it gently. What part does he just allow? My child, here's something fun for you. Try for free. Try for free. Talking out comes to the down. Oh. Bloody frog. Don't be so furious. The ocean dried and I'm alone again. <laughs> Thank 
hurt something. I didn't say goodbye and they left me, right? Yeah, right. Like always. Pride goes before the fall. I've been there. You better take it. Seems what they said is true. I can't do it. I just want everything to be back to normal. Is that too much? There should have been ways to undo it. But now, even I am confounded. Your pain is real. Then... You said you can't do it, not that you don't want to, right? The arcane skill with conditions cannot be taken back once it is cast. Just like the irretrievable curses and vows in Siberian shamanism. I can see some markings on this girl's skull, like an unknown seal. I've been speculating about what caused the limitation of her power. This may be the reason why she's in pain. A seal powerful enough to change one's marking on the bones is not to be easily broken. Skull? I don't know what you're talking about. Turn them into Lushus, but not the opposite way. Maybe... Maybe I can't be a Xiang Rei at all. I'm not qualified. Alright. There's one more question that seems to be overlooked by us all. How many people have drunk Zhe Neng liquor? In the merry festival spirit, 